few years ago, uh, it was reported on ABC Evening News that two principals, one I think was from Seattle, Washington, and the other one was from um, Omaha, Nebraska. They got together and they scanned the country. What they did, they went throughout the country talking to young people. And these young people, believe it or not, they lived on the street. And they asked them one question. What do you, what do you want or what did you want from your parents? Majority of them answered like this. All I wanted was love and discipline. I did not get love. I did not get discipline. A child, believe it or not, as weird as it may sound, a child wants to be disciplined. A child, nurtured. A child wants, thank you, a child wants to be put back in line. It's just like a dog. And, and I'm, <laughs> you know, it's just like a dog. You know, if you put a dog in, and if we got any animal lovers in here, well, I had five of them. And I, no, I, all five of them are dead. No, my name is not Michael Vick. I'm not Ken Vick. <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank you. Yeah, well, good thing you're not. Tiger Wolf, oh, I've been not use that name either. No, no, no. But anyway, <laughs> with my dog, all right, sure, I kept him on a leash. A leash, all right? Now, my dog, as smart as he was one day, after I get in my car, or, or I lock the gate, get in my car, and I drive off. All right? And I left the dog to roam. That particular day, I let him roam around in the yard. I come back home in the evening. The fence is open. So I asked my wife, I said, baby, did you leave the gate open? No, I didn't. Okay, did anybody come in? Where, where's the dog at? I don't know. Come to find out, the dog let himself out. The dog actually used his paw to lift the, the gate up. The Smart. gate, yeah. All right. So guess what? When I let that dog go off that leash, he took it a step further. Yeah. When you take that leash, if you will, off a child who is looking for your love, looking for your discipline, looking for your instructions. <clears throat> all right. Well, once they realize that, okay, let me go here and try. Mm -hmm. Let me go here and try. Mm -hmm. Oh. Then they go further. Well, the further they go, the more trouble they seek. Mm -hmm. All right? And when it comes back down, I was thinking today, the last thing a mother want in her young life is to be sitting on that front pew. Yeah. And I've seen that scene so many times. A young mother had to sit on that front pew in black with tears, crying a river. Because their son is on zero, frozen stiff, either because of gang warfare or because they took it one step too far.